Welcome back to Magic Tarot Cards. This is Jasmine. I have a video here for you. This is going to be about Queen Elizabeth, the one that just passed away. I know everyone's been watching the news. This is her final thoughts and feelings about her whole life, the situation, and everything that um, that has happened to her up to this point. And yeah, so I've been doing a lot of praying, a lot of meditating with my spirit guides to see if I can reach her and see what energy I can pick up and have her come forth. And this is what I've got here. I had to shuffle a whole lot and this is what I have here. I don't normally, when I do these type of readings, I don't shuffle in on the camera because I shuffle like for 20 minutes straight and I don't think anyone wants to see all, all that. Um, sometimes I shuffle on, on camera, sometimes I don't. So if that bothers you, well, you don't have to, um, you know, watch, okay? I do things my way because this is my page. Other than that, feel free to comment, like, share, and subscribe. Um, everything else is in the disclaimer box. Don't forget about my cup, y'all. This is my magic cup. And, um, yeah, what you do is you write down your, um what you want to manifest on paper and then you put it underneath the cup but you're going to pray on it and then drink from from it and this is for money health love and um good health love and money <laughs> sorry i'm in my car and i'm not going to explain again why i'm in my car but i'm doing this reading in my car someone keeps texting me so it's messing up my video if it's shaking it's because i'm literally holding uh the camera in my hand and please ignore my fingernails so with that being said let's get started if you want a personal reading contact me with the email down below please don't send money unless it's a tip for a reading that, that I have not talked to you about if you want a personal reading make sure I've talked to you about it and I've set the appointment and then you can send your payment okay because a lot of people send payments and I don't know who it's coming from because I don't know your usernames and yeah okay so anyway, here we go. Feel free to leave a tip if you want to. Okay, so I asked final thoughts and feelings, what her feelings are about everything that's happened, if she has any messages for her family or what she wants to say. And the first one I got is the Ace of Swords. If you notice, it's in the reverse. In the upright, this is victory, okay? This is the queen, the crown. You see the crown of victory? But it's double-edged, so this can... Uh, this is going to go back and forth anytime. So I am seeing that she reigned as queen for a very, very, very long time. But towards the end, I do feel like um, her energy was getting low. Very low, I guess, you know, as she aged, her energy for uh, her assignment as a queen was getting very low. So it came up in the reverse, meaning that um, there was times that she felt even being as a queen, she wasn't, um, how can you say this? Uh, this is hard to explain that she wasn't at like getting a message across let me put it that way especially when it came to her family she felt like she wasn't getting a message across all right I don't know who is texting me but it's messing up my video so I am seeing here the knight of swords this is a message coming in really really fast when the knight of swords comes in this is a message that comes in really really fast um this is about her health because there was no indication not really out there in the public that she was gonna pass away or be gone that quickly um this is something that comes quickly so she's saying that her end of her life came quickly without you know any messages without um you know the public knowing that it was going to end that quickly and i'm hearing that she's sorry for that she's sorry that it happened so fast that there was no warning or anything like that it, you pretty much had to um i'm hearing that you pretty much had to pay attention to surrounding events or coming events for for you to know that this was going to happen to her and um, but that's what this card represents information coming in really fast so it did come in really fast for her and without any warning and she wants to apologize for that i'm hearing that she's sorry for that and there's no reason for her to be sorry for that because you know we all are going to be at that point one day where our lives do end you know god didn't promise us forever here so yeah and then we also have the six of cups here i'm seeing that she's thinking about her past this is 
childhood past, childhood friendship, childhood friends. I am seeing that she has crossed over. She is with her family members and she's with people from her past. She's also reflecting on her past when she was a child. See, these are two children loving each other giving each other a cup of love all these cups down here represent family members things from the past she's feeling very nostalgic right now meaning she's going into her past thinking about her past visiting with the past and things like that she's very happy about that very happy to see her family very happy to um, be around them and and remember the past she wants people to remember the past i'm hearing please visit the past i'm seeing visit the past those words keep coming into my head she's saying visit the past okay meaning she wants people to remember her not just of right now but from her past okay things about her from the past now next sorry y'all i'm in an awkward position here so now next we have the queen of pentacles this is literally her she led a great life she's saying she led a great life she's like this queen here um if you notice, there's reefs around her with flowers. Uh, she manifested a whole lot. And she's saying that even though things were passed down to her, you know, from her husband or from generation to generation, she literally worked, uh, did a lot of work on her own that brought her the rain, the sitting on the, on the chair here with the crown that brought her her reign herself, reigning as a queen, that it wasn't just handed to her. She wants people to know that. It wasn't just handed to her. She also actually worked hard to get that reign. She worked hard to get her own money. Here's the money that she's looking. She's literally looking at the money in her lap. She then thought about it. See, the blue back represents thought, but the yellow represents a brand new day. So she is saying that she did work hard. It wasn't just handed handed to her because she knows that some people say oh well it was just handed to her you know she was lucky blah 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 she's also saying that she worked hard at what she did she didn't just sit there on her throne and do nothing okay and the things that she did did bring in a brand new day for a lot of people not just herself but for a lot of people sorry y'all these are all messed up okay so next we have the oh goodness let me get these out of the way the ones i've already read Okay, so next we have the Hierophant. This is the the lure of confirmation. The Hierophant means the lure of confirmation. The judge, the people that have the final say so. And I'm, I'm seeing that this could mean many things for her. Saying that she did reign like this judge. She did have final say so on a lot of things. But also her past family members did as well the lure of confirmation meaning that it's confirmed what happened to her it's confirmed you know what's coming in next i'm also seeing prince charles here she's ref she's referring to prince charles here that he is reigning next and he will have the final say so in this next reign so i'm seeing her leaning towards that as well she's mentioning his name she's saying that he will have the final say so from this point on okay now we're talking about she's moving towards her her demise or what's happened which is the um four of swords this is when someone is tired that they can't go on anymore and she's referring to that this is how she was feeling in the last days that she has fought as hard as she could um that she just couldn't go on anymore she has come to the end swords are always meaning an ending okay so this is when someone is very tired and they have to lay down they're praying for strength and this is how she was towards the end she was referring to um leading this good life but she was also tired she just she couldn't go on anymore she knew that her time was coming and she did her job i mean i'm hearing that she did her job she did what she was supposed to do she has completed she completed what she was supposed to do she knew that it was done um job well done i'm hearing job well done either she's saying that or someone's saying that to her but she did what she was supposed to do and she was tired and she was ready to you know be in peace be rest up be in peace you know and go wherever she was supposed to go i do see that she has crossed over she is in the light she is exactly where she needs to be um crossed over i didn't get the hangman the hangman usually means crossing over but i did get this where she is in you know in heaven with her family members and being very nostalgic with the past now she's referring to family feuds here this is a lot of people fighting each other this is something that really really disturbed her maybe she didn't mention it 
in public or mention it to them. But she's saying family feuds here that she was not happy about. She did not like it. Bothered her tremendously. Regardless of color. She's saying I'm hearing color. I'm guessing color of skin. That she was not the type that would judge people on color of skin even though she came from a time that did she's saying that she was not that way that she welcomed that girl i'm sorry i don't know her name please forgive me i don't know her name the one that the boy married that's you know darker skin or whatever she is I'm, i really don't know these people so i can't really refer to the races but she is saying that she um was never against it she was she welcomed her in and she wanted everybody else to welcome her and she doesn't approve of the fighting that goes on in the family she didn't like that she wasn't um happy about that she wasn't happy about any fighting that went on she doesn't she didn't want that in her family she didn't want that in her family okay so she's really wanting that to be fixed gossip i'm hearing a lot of gossip this this card comes up when there's a lot of gossip she wants the gossip to stop just dead stop is what she's saying she doesn't want no more gossip no more family feeding no nothing she's like, everyone is welcomed in her family and that's the way she wants it she wants everyone to feel welcome and, and at peace i am seeing someone here this is another sword someone that's coming in for an apology um she's referring to someone here that made up rumors or lies and they'll be coming back to apologize or to make amends and that's what she wants her final say so is to make amends in the family she wants the family to be strong move forward stop being fighting gossiping fighting each other um make amends tell the truth um, she's real big on telling the truth okay she doesn't want any of that anymore in her family she doesn't want that to be the legacy of her family she doesn't want gossip she doesn't want um sides being taken she wants everyone to be together in one big happy family regardless of color color i keep hearing that word color regardless of you know what a person may look like she doesn't want that she wants everyone to be happy together in one big union and keep reigning the way you're supposed to take your post she's saying take your post and be the person that you were intended to be take your post you know be that king prince or princess or i'm sorry whatever you're supposed to be she's saying take your post i keep hearing that take your post be who you're supposed to be take up your position and just do it that's what she wants just do it quit fighting each other quit quit uh saying things about each other quit gossiping and take your post that is her final word y'all that is her final word may she rest in peace and uh she will move forward from here and be where she's supposed to be i do feel like she's happy she's completed her karmic cycle here and she will be visiting i'm hearing visiting you know leading I'm, I'm hearing that she will come back and lead them spiritually and hope that they will all go in the right direction all right y'all this is it for now thanks for watching this is jasmine from magic tarot cards bye bye